about his ability to throw it any way you want it. Soft, accurate, and when he needs to, he can put a lot of heat on it and put it between defenders. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. They need to get the playoff. It's first down as they head to the line. He's scrambling now, eyeing that left side. That's an interception. He's into the open. A He's in for the score. What a catch, what an interception. And not only that, take it all the way back for a touchdown. You talk about deflating for an offense. Oh, shoot, that, that gets close to making them quit. It's still too early in this one. The Steelers are leading by seven. Escapes the hit. Tackles made. Number 18 on the return. Defense with plenty of bodies in the box here on this play. They're setting up screen. With two hands, he has it. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. When you get an offense backed up, use that momentum. You know they're going to be careful, so you can be aggressive. Maybe even take a chance on the defensive side and see if you can get a safety or pin them back even farther. Defense filling up the box here with a 4-6 formation. And he makes the catch just past the first down marker. Nice job by the offense picking up that first down here. start the game and that is important to give you a little confidence to give you some rhythm and most of all just release some of that pressure you feel let's see how they back up the big play here Safety valve time. That pass was hurried. Well, what do you want them to do? They design a play, the guy's wide open, the protection is great, and just an awful throw by the quarterback. When you get situations like that, you must take advantage of that. NFL quarterbacks cannot miss wide open receivers. Second down following that incompletion. The quarterback throws the pass. When it's third long on the offensive side, you have very few choices on how to pick up a first down. Call one of them and see if you get lucky and see if it works. Third down now. Looking across the middle, no separation at all. Incomplete. Good job that time by the defense. They get the fourth down situation here. They were bending a little bit, but they didn't give up the big play. Good job. The corners are going to meet the receivers right on the line of scrimmage. Looks to his left. Has the reception all alone. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Nothing like getting these big plays early game and getting that home crowd behind you. 
They, they believe in their football team. They think this is going to happen all day long, and everybody right now is feeling pretty good. Play number six coming up on this drive. Now first and ten. Screen pass. Ball's on the ground. He's brought to a halt. That is not a turnover. That is truly a takeaway by the defense. Their hustle to the football, the hard hitting, that's what got them the takeaway. The Steelers come onto the field now for this next series. First down coming up. They hand it off to the running back. And he's brought down by Charles Woodson. The great thing about the draw play, just for a split second, the defense thinks it's pass. Now they're reacting instead of attacking and allows you to get a few extra yards. Go, 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 Quarterback go. sees something in his defense he wants to take advantage of. Look at the hand signals he's given to the receiver outside. Well, it's about deceiving the defense, isn't it? That's how you get a lot done in the NFL. And when you can run and pass, you can deceive them in a lot of ways. Nice job by the offense running that football, picking up another first down and moving the chains. That big gainer on the ground gives them now a first down. They'll run with it again. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. Back to the running back, heading right. That last play was a run. Third down coming up. He'll throw it over the middle. Airtight coverage, incomplete. Look, when you get that kind of time to throw the football as a quarterback, you got to make a better throw than that. Great job by the offensive line. Poor job by the quarterback. Hey, how about this decision? They're not going to punt it. They're going to try to pick up the first down. Yeah, the draw play, it's been around forever, and it is still a valuable asset to all offenses. Make the defense think past. You hand it off, you get them retreating, and you can pick up a few extra yards. Play number six coming up on this drive. Going across the middle, no one in sight has the grab. This offense, they are methodical, aren't they? They're kind of boring to watch. First down, first down, first down. Two, two. The quarterback up, mixing go. things up at the line of scrimmage. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Mindenhall. And it's Charles Woodson in on the tackle. Good job by the running back that time. Breaking tackles, finding the open hole, and picking up those extra yards. This will be the eighth play of this drive. He drops back to throw, running away from the pressure. And he's brought down by A.J. Hawk. Defense is about discipline. And when you lose discipline, big plays happen. That time, the defensive pass rushers, a little overzealous. They get out of the rush lanes. The quarterback gets outside and makes the play. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. Second and short, the handoff to Richard Mendenhall. Well, it's another first down for the offense, and I'll tell you who the happiest guys are here in this stadium right now. It's the defensive players sitting over on the sideline, getting a drink of water, having a little oxygen, the fan blowing on them. It's nice this time of day to be a defender. That is play number 10 on this drive. Running for his life. An incompletion right there, but it really should have been an interception. Nice job by the quarterback. He gets quick pressure, able to get outside the pocket and keep this play alive. This will be the 11th play of the drive. Second down and eight. Trying to work the middle of the field. Throws it incomplete into double coverage. That was excellent man-to-man -man coverage that time. When you want to shut down a receiver, 
really the only way to do it is to man up and play him one-on-one. -on -one. Play number 12 coming up for the offense. Third down and eight. And he wants to throw it across the middle. Reaches in, and that pass is incomplete. Well, the quarterback had all day long that time, and he just couldn't, he couldn't make the throw, so we got a little incompletion there. Should be an easy one here. Never take it for granted. When you're trying a field goal, a lot of things could go wrong, but good execution that time by the offense and a good kick. Three points. Randall Cobb ready to run with this return. He's brought down. Playing press coverage to the outside. Into the open flat. Bringing the play to an end. Look at that throwing lane that time. My gosh, it's, it looks like the Lincoln Tunnel. Nobody in the line of sight for the quarterback. Clear view down the field and a nice throw. They come to the line, and it's first down. Challenging the defenders to the right side. When you see defenses playing man-to-man -man coverage, what they are saying, we are going to force the quarterback to make an accurate throw. Well, that time, that was accurate. That's why they got the completion. First down, following the long play. First and ten. Looking to the right side and throwing. And it's Polamamu who's able to bring him down. Nice job that time getting that extra yard and getting that first down. This offense methodically just marching down the field. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Fakes out the defender right there on the spot. This is where games are won and lost. Once an offense gets down the red zone, even though they're down more than seven, can you find a way to punch it in there for the touchdown and not settle for a field goal? That reception gave them the first down. And the quarterback is taken down. The name of the game is hit the guy with the football, isn't it? That's what it is. The quarterback has it. The defensive end, what a nice play. Gets to him that time and gets the big hit. Defense comes to the line, ready to pounce on that quarterback one more time. Troy Polamalu has an interception. In on the stop. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. Let's go, let's go. The quarterback's calling something out. Offense lines up here. First and ten. Roethlisberger going down. That ball has been picked off. All right, well, I have to say that's just a terrible decision by the quarterback there. He's got to know when you're in a situation like this, you just cannot make that type of pass. Big moment here for the defense. Lined up in the 46 defense. Wide open for the catch. They deck him in the backfield. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. And we've reached the two-minute warning. These DBs will not back off. Second down and a long way to go. That brings the play to an end. Good job by the play caller that time. Calling for the short pass, even though it comes up short of the first down, it opens up many things that you can do on third. You can run a reverse, 
draw plays, screen plays, or if you want, you can still throw it down the field. Got a hand on it, and it's incomplete. Can't complain about the offensive line play that time. Quarterback just not able to make the throw. Time that timeout by the offense. Not sure why they're going to go for it at this point, but they are. They're not going to punt. Greg Jennings with the grab. Touchdown. This game is tight. Well, it's a good touchdown by the offense there. And, you know, what it's done, it's gotten this game closer. He has some confidence, and confidence is a dangerous thing. We'll see if they can keep moving forward after this. Packers now ready to kick the football down the field. Breaks free, has some space to work with. Finds the sacred side. Touchdown. This kick returner, he's so good, you always have to pay attention to him. Even when he catches the football in the end zone, he will bring it out. He is dynamic. We see why he brings that football out. Makes people miss. Has great speed and takes it all the way for the touchdown. Sean Sweezum readying his team for the kickoff. Randall Cobb ready to run with this return. He's brought down at the 20 yard line. Number 18 on the return. First down, offense ready for the snap. Scrambling out of the pocket. Aaron Rodgers way down. That ball is picked off. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. There's the quarterback barking out new signals. First down and 10. Nick Perry has the sack. The quarterback's got to know when it's inside of two minutes and that clock is moving, you want to get the football down the field and out of bounds. Holds on to the football too long. Gets the sack, and that just kills uh, the time management. Here we go. Black five. Black five. Quarterback drops back. He'll fire it out to the left. A takeaway. Jukes him, and he's brought to the ground. Good job by the defensive back. Reading the wide receiver, makes the break at the perfect time, and gets the interception. Defense comes out in a 4-6 formation. Working that left side. Here's the pass, and it's broken up incomplete. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. Big set here for the defense, lining up in the 4-6. The quarterback throws the pass. That ball is going the other way. Good piece of tackling. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. No one was open. What a good job by the defensive back that time. That ball was thrown beautifully down the field. High arcing throw, but the defensive back in great position knocks it down. Coming up, second down. Five-step drop, looking across the middle. Antonio Brown with the catch. And the offense will call the timeout. The margin of error against man-to-man -man defense is much smaller for a quarterback than it would be against zone defenses. That time the quarterback right on target, good throw. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Staying with the passing game on first down. 
great coverage there on that pass attempt. Got to give the secondary credit. This passing league now, it's hard to make plays, but a good play there and another incomplete pass. Failing to complete that one, so second down here. Quarterback dropping back, looking to get the feet planted. Scans the field. Tackle down at the 22. That's going to be a timeout charge to the offense. Third and short following the completion. Third down and one. Nick Perry has the sack. That's an excellent job by the defense. Just gets quick penetration in there. Gets the quarterback and gets the sack. That clock keeps moving. What a job by the defense in this situation. This is going to be a long field goal attempt. The field goal try. Yes, sir. So that's going to do it for the first half. Steelers are up here in this one. We'll be back with our halftime report after the break. We're back here now in this one where the Steelers lead by 13. Backed up at that point. Steelers ready to take over the football. No margin for error here with the offense. Richard Mendenhall gets the carry. Number 34, the ball carry. No gain on the play. It's now second down. Another carry here. Clay Matthews makes the hit. You got to keep your offensive lineman aggressive, so you have to run the football every once in a while. That run, even though it was a short game, it served a purpose. Two, two. The quarterback coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. The quarterback's hollering out instructions. It's a throw all the way. The Packers turned the ball over on downs. That was a terrible job that time by the offense. The head coach decides to go for it on fourth down. Uh, the play is there. The players just did a terrible job of executing. What a place to start for the offense. He's looking to the right here on this throw. That's a gain of six. Well, even though they're down more than seven here, the offense down the red zone, it'll be good for them for the rest of this game. Their confidence uh, for the offensive coach that they can punch this in for the touchdown. Second down coming up. And he's taken down. Makes the sack. 13-yard loss on the play. The quarterback is coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. No way that would be completed. Nice job that time by the defense. Pressure on the quarterback. He does not have time to find an open guy, and it results in an incompletion. The kick is good. Well, when you have legs like this guy, of course you can kick it a long way. It looks like it should be a defensive lineman, but one leg strength and a good kick there. Mason Crosby ready to kick. He's brought down at the 25-yard line.
First down here. Mendenhall, middle. He's got some daylight. When you see a long run like that, you know what it does? It just breaks the will of the defense. In the NFL, it's all about passing. We see all these wonderful things. But when it comes down to it, who can win the war up front? And you win the war by running the football. Great job by of the offensive line that time. Getting away from the pressure. The flag is out as the play continues. And the throw is incomplete. That penalty is, of course, going to be accepted by the defense. Let's go! The quarterback has his team's attention here. After that penalty, it's now second and 14. Dropping back to throw. Gets a hand on that one to knock it away. I think that's the hardest pass a defensive back has to defend. The long throws down the field. You have to wait to the last second to make your play. That time the defensive back did it. What a play. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. The give to the running back. He's brought down. That's going to bring up fourth down. about this we're trying to pick up the first down on fourth down forgetting the punt these first downs add up it's like body punches in a fight you keep hitting guys to the body they get tired they give up that's what's happening to this defense right now that was a big gainer now it's time to back it up now in rhythm the quarterback drops back to throw once more Steelers in for the touchdown well, there's an old saying in the NFL, you know how many points you need? And the answer is more. So no matter what the lead is, keep trying to score. Nice job by the offense getting that extra touchdown. The Packers are back deep, ready to return. They pounce on him there. Green Bay Packers getting ready now to start their drive. The defense comes out of the nickel, out of the gun, running away from the sack. He'll throw it over the middle. The pass is incomplete. There was no one open. We see it so often nowadays, all quarterbacks moving around the pocket. That time he gets outside the pocket, but as he looks down the field, nowhere to throw it, nobody open. Just another incomplete pass. Going across the middle, under fire on that throw. Terrible job by the offensive line. Your quarterback needs more time than that. Uh, another incompletion. Third down. The quarterback throws to the right. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Good job by the defense. Staying in the right spots. They give up the short pass. They make the tackle. And now we have fourth down coming up. Hey, how about this decision? They're not going to punt it. They're going to try to pick up the first down. They bring him to the turf. The defense thinks they have the guys to play man-to-man -man coverage down the field. Well, they didn't that time. The receiver made a nice little move, gets open, and a good throw by the quarterback. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Hold on a minute. There's an injured player on the field. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is, I think he's going to be okay. And once he gets a little um, uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. 
Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football, and it leads to another incomplete pass. Play number six coming up on this drive. Cedric Benson takes the handoff. 32 hits the call. One yard loss on the play. Some good news on the injury. It does not appear to be as serious as we first thought, and he is expected to get back into this game. Yeah, he's going to come back in. I mean, that's good news for him. I don't know if the team's too happy about it because he's playing awful. But, you know, if he gets back out there, maybe he can change things around. These defensive backs are ready for a battle. He'll fire it out to the left. They fail to convert, and now a change of possession. Good job by the defense that time. Fourth down, they were ready for everything. Very aggressive, fast. They make the play, and this could change let's go, let's the game go. around. Quarterback sees something in his defense he wants to take advantage of. Look at the hand signals he's given to the receiver outside. Here's the long throw by Roethlisberger. Wow, what a catch. There's just so few quarterbacks who know how to throw it high and far anymore. Nice job that time by the quarterback. That throw was right on the money. The defense at this point trying to keep him out of the end zone. Trying to work that left side. Reaches in, swats it away. Nice job by the offensive line that time. Quarterback has all day. Nobody open, though. Another incompletion. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. Looking to the right side and throwing. Breaks the plane, and it's a touchdown. Never be satisfied in the NFL. Players are just too good. So when you get a chance to score, even though you're leading, take advantage of it. Awesome job by the coordinator on those play calls. Steelers setting up here for the kickoff. Randall Cobb ready to run with this return. Defense with plenty of bodies in the box here on this play. Trying to make something happen under pressure and incomplete. Well, that's a good job by my man. Really good effort. Gets outside the pocket. And, but boy, once he gets outside the pocket, that's a terrible throw. Second down coming up. Looking for an open receiver on the right. On the money. Breaks free. He's got the touchdown. That's a nice touchdown there. And you chip it away at that lead. Try to get into the minds of the opponent. Will they get tight? If you hear the word choke, yeah, I think they could be choking over there on the other side. Look out. Press coverage all the way. Lining up now for the two. The formation here, shotgun. He's looking to put an additional two points on the board as they convert. Mason Crosby ready for the kickoff. There's a flag out as they run down the field. He's going to be tackled right around the 21-yard line. Holding by the receiving team. The First defense down. will take the penalty. The Steelers get ready to start their drive. Tough starting field position here. First and ten. The quarterback throws to the right. He's brought down at the 20-yard line. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. I don't even want to speculate what the injury is, but 
I think it's safe to say by just watching the player, he's in a lot of pain, and I hope it's not serious. The quarterback mixing things up at the line of scrimmage. To the ground here. And it's Clay Matthews in on the play. Well, this team is definitely committed to the run. There's no doubt about it. And when you're committed to the running game, hey, a lot of them are not going to work. That's okay. Stay with it. The quarterback's calling something out. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. Touchdown, Pittsburgh Steelers. This is not one of the faster running backs in the NFL. So for him to get through the line of scrimmage and go for a long touchdown run, you've got to blame the defense. Bad angles of attack, no doubt about it, but lack of hustle gives up the touchdown. Extra point is good. It's getting late in this one. The Steelers lead by 23. He's got a chance to return this one. He's going to be tackled right around the 21-yard line. Packers come onto the field for their next series. Defense filling up the box here with a 4-6 formation. And he's thrown to the ground. The offensive line that time had no idea this cornerback was coming on the blitz. He timed it perfectly, and the speed and the talent to get there, and he gets the sack on the QB. Second down now. Looking to scramble. Makes the catch in the open field. Well, that was an awesome job that time by the quarterback getting out of the pocket. He keeps the play alive and able to throw it down the field for a nice completion. Third and five still to go, even after that last completion. Trying to work the middle of the field, and it's knocked down. Well, they keep giving him this much time to throw. Sooner or later, he is going to find an open guy and complete a pass. Not sure why they're going to go for it at this point, but they are. They're not going to punt. Easy catch there. No one near him. Six Touchdown. on the board for the Packers. When you're behind in the football game, drive down and score. They did that. Now the next time when they get back out there, they got to do it again. Show some patience and drive it down the field. Looks like they're in press coverage here. They'll get set, looking to convert on this two-point try. Makes the catch in open space. They failed to convert on the two-point try, so they'll just have to settle for the six. The Steelers set to return the kick. Defense has them wrapped up. What a good job by the kickoff team. The ball's kicked high in the air, and they sprint all the way down there. The blockers can't get set up. Nice tackle. Now they got great field position for the defense. Go, 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 go. What a go, difficult go. spot to be in from here. Two, two. Five, five. This is a five-step drop back. Roethlisberger going down the field. Clutch catch. It's just not done enough, I think, in the league anymore. Everybody's so careful. But look what can happen. You can have the perfect throw, the perfect catch, and a big play. They face first down. Back to the air here on first down. Here's the long throw by Roethlisberger. For so many years, we had all these rinky dink dink and dunk quarterbacks. Now we got guys in there throwing it deep down the field. What a nice catch. What a really good deep throw. Two minutes to go before this one's in the books. The offense getting set. The goal line in sight. 
Play fake here, challenging the defenders to the right side. Touchdown. When you got a lead and you march down the field and you add on that lead with a touchdown, it's fun to watch the other team. Will they stay patient or will they panic? My bet is they'll panic. Count it. Following the extra point, the Steelers lead by 24. He'll have a chance to take off. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. Number 18 on the return. The Packers getting set now for their next series. Big moment here for the defense. Lined up in the 46 defense. First and 10. Gets away from the heat. Just had to avoid the sack. Incomplete. It's not all about speed at the quarterback position, running away from trouble. You're able to take a couple steps up, a couple steps sideways, get that extra time, avoid the sack, and still throw the football. And here we have second down. And he wants to throw it across the middle. Touchdown, Green Bay Packers. What a good job by the wide receiver. Not a terrific pass, but he just goes in there, makes a wonderful catch for the touchdown. The corners are going to meet the receivers right on the line of scrimmage. They're going to bypass the point after and try to pick up the two-point conversion. Could have taken the one-point gimme. They went for the two, and they are turned away. They'll take it at the 20. Steelers are getting set for their next possession. Hurry up, let's go. Nickel formation let's here go, for the defense. Steps back to throw. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. Interception. That'll stop the play right there. That interception is strictly on the quarterback. When you make bad decisions, I don't care how good you can throw the football. The results, usually it's going to turn into an interception. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Good quarter. Ball's picked off. Nice tackle. That was a terrible throw by the quarterback. When you're off target like that, you deserve to throw an interception. Hey. Offense lines up here. First and ten. The quarterback will hand it off. He's got some daylight, not giving up another inch. When you see a long run like that, you know what it does? It just breaks the will of the defense. In the NFL, it's all about passing. We see all these wonderful things. But when it comes down to it, who can win the war up front? And you win the war by running the football. Great job by the offensive line that time. Pump thing. Nick Perry has the sack. It is truly a bonus when you can take your outside linebacker and let him rush the quarterback and he can get a sack. Nice job that time by the outside linebacker. That's a timeout by the D. That leads us to second down. Looking to the right side and throwing. They knocked him down behind the line of scrimmage. When you play zone coverage, the quarterback might have to hold the football just a little longer. But these guys nowadays, when you play zone, they know how to throw and catch and get it done. Go, 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 go! They bring in an extra defensive back. There's some shifting around in the backfield. That's a pass all the way. Throwing now to his left. 
breaks free. Defense wraps him up. Good job of getting this football down in the red zone. The lead, very small. Got to be smart in how you dial up these plays from here. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Reaches out and grabs it. Oh, man, he almost gets in the end zone so close to getting over the goal line. That's going to do it. The clock hits zero, and this game has come to an end. And coming up next is the post-game wrap-up, brought to you by Gatorade G-Series Recovery.